What's up guys? Welcome to Mondo's channel and in today's video, I am going to share about how to fix the error 522 on your website. So let's go! Okay, so let us start with understanding about what error 522 means. So error 522 is another type of website error that means connection time out. So you often uh, see this kind of error on your web browser. If your web browser could not uh, process and complete the request, the error would pop up HTTP error 522 connection time out. So that is exactly what error 522 is. So to further understand what HTTP error 522 means is that HTTP error 522 connection time out occurs when the TCP handshake between the web server and the cloud flag fails and become an error. So this handshake is actually essential in establishing the request of a web server to run as normal. So when the CDN service actually receives requests from the users um, upon needing a consultation with the web server, therefore this error 522 occurs. So now you roughly understand what actually HTTP error 522 means. But let us go further down on what are the common causes of this HTTP 522 error. So the first one would be web server offline. If the web server that you're trying to contact to is offline, then this HTTP 522 error might occur. Since for the communication uh, between the web server and the cloud flare occurs via the internet, so obviously when the web server is offline, this exchange could take place. Therefore, it results in the HTTP 522 connection type of error. Okay. So uh, moving on to the next common causes of uh, HTTP 522 error to occur, it would be overloading the original server. So uh, actually Cloudflare needs to work a lot with the uh, web, original web server in order for it to run the uh, project, to keep running the project of the web server. So uh, sometimes for certain requests from the browser users, especially that has dynamic content, the CDN service needs to contact with the original web server. So um, for the browser that doesn't have a CDN service, therefore this usually result in a timeout and overload uh, when the TCP is trying to build. And uh, this also occurs when there are too many requests from the user and then the CDN could not connect with the original server and couldn't build the TCP handshake, therefore results in timeout and overload and this will cause the error 522 connection timeout to occur. So, moving on to the third reason of why HTTP error 522 could occur. So, it would be uh, the firewall is actually blocking the web server. So, the original web server sometimes has its own firewall or connector do up with it along. So, when this firewall could not uh, recognize the IP address, this will actually block the uh, web server and preventing it from uh, working and optimizing like normal. So this can also cause the HTTP 522 connection timeout error. Um, actually, technically, um, a firewall should uh, recognize the IP address with the default settings of your web server. But sometimes, uh, IP addresses can be randomly and accidentally blocked sometimes also due to the incorrect IP settings. So uh, therefore, these are the reason why the HTTP 522 error connection timeout can occur to your web browser at times. But don't worry and don't panic. Whenever you encounter this kind of HTTP 522 connection timeout error occur, there are always ways to fix and resolve it. So I am here today to share the tips with you. So, the first step that I'm going to share with you guys on how to resolve this error 522 would be optimize your server capacity. Sometimes, overloading of web server can cause error 522 to occur. So therefore, you need to keep track and analyze the traffic development of your web server with installing any kind of analysis software. So this way, you can 
actually analyze and keep track when does the traffic of the your web server become speeds, how many users daily access your website, and how many users actually become extremely uh, assessing your website at what time. So these kind of things, when you keep track and analyze, you know when to actually take action and keep optimizing your website so that it could prevent the error of 522 connection. So next, the second step that I would suggest you to take in order to prevent error 522 would be check your IP filtering. So in order to ensure that your IP addresses of your web server are actually not being blocked by the firewall, then you need to check your IP filtering. Sometimes the IP addresses are actually being filtered in the file called .htaccess file. So therefore, you need to always check your IP filtering so that somewhere or anywhere your IP addresses are not actually being blocked to ensure that all the users can access the web server without any problem and especially, importantly, without the HTTP 522 connection timeout error. Last but not least, you also have the option to actually contact the Cloudflare support to resolve this error 522 issues. So what you can do is that you can actually prepare a ticket stating the problems that you face uh, involving this error. And also the CDN provider suggests you can use tools such as the MTR or the trace route to actually encounter what are the main problems regarding this error. So when you about to contact your support, Cloudflare support, you can actually insert this ticket in file or even in text format stating in which areas you actually have already checked about the error and also the result of uh, using the CDN provider suggested tools that is the MTR and also the trace route. you can insert the result along in the ticket and you can contact your Cloudflare support along by giving them this ticket so that this would actually uh, speed up the process of resolving your 522 error issues. So that's all from me today and I hope at the end of this video, I actually help you on how to fix the error 522 connection time up on your website. But, ah uh, ah uh, ah, uh, but wait, don't forget to give this video a thumbs up, like, comment, subscribe and share to our Mundus channel. Till we meet again, bye!